Oh. Ah, well, you... Here we go. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's not the most graceful of entries, but it'll do. Welcome back to Skyward Sword. And I hope you're ready for fail because you're going to see plenty of it. <laughs> you're about a half hour worth, that is. I'm guessing you suck at the trial. Well, let's just say it's because I, I wasn't able to figure out how to get back to the goal after I crossed the sand. Ah. You'll see. Eventually, on the, thir on the fourth, third or fourth try, I actually got it. And now, more simlish singing. You mean scream. Okay, screaming. Nehru's wisdom. First thing the Vocaloid girls can do this better. Hmm. Uh. <laughs> okay. Are we ready to begin this trial? Fortunately, you can. Add, there's no limits to how many times you can retry a trial, except that you have to start all over again. Well, more chances to get dust relics. That's true. You need plenty of them. And of course, as usual, a rearrange of the overall area theme. Nice. Uh, anyway. Plenty of those uh, seekers, or whatever they are. All right, and of course, as usual, we are unarmed. Fall turns on your mind alone, as, is, as it is in every silent realm. They'll test your wisdom. Uh, if it's to test wisdom, we should, you know, solve puzzles or something. Exactly. Yeah. And the trial of power would be a small boss rush. Or at least a mook rush. But no. One trick ponies. Uh, do you have questions? Uh, yes? Well, in case anyone's uh, forgotten how to do these. This will be the only time, babe. Alright. But yeah, to, to recap, you gotta collect the tears without getting attacked by the guardians. Or spotted by the searchlight dudes. Mm -hmm. Never mind. Okay. Once we leave the circle, they wake up. Oh boy. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, uh, I gotta find it. What's the closest way? Fortunately, to they return to their start point whenever you uh, catch one. Mm -hmm. A tear of Nero. <laughs> unfortunately, this takes me about three or four tries. For well, either fortunately or unfortunately. At least I didn't get stuck for like an hour on this. At least there's that much. To the end, the constant retries actually help, considering that any tears you collect will be marked on the map. So I guess in a way, it does pay to uh, do a little trial and error. But uh, as Fee will mention, the first time you fail, the best method is to search for the tiers that are hard to find first, and then save the easy to find tiers for when you really need them. Okay. I will be honest, the Silent Realms really creep me out. That's slightly the point. Mm -hmm. ah. <laughs> oh. When you do sink into the sand, you just dissolve. 
since you're not really have you don't really have a physical form right now. Okay, where to next? Well, I will admit, to, I will. Yeah, like I said before, there's gonna be plenty of fail in this part, and there will be some fail when we get to Din's and as well as the Goddess's trials. I think only, I think only failed twice with both of them. <laughs> so it doesn't. I, I will say this much: most likely, this is the one tryout that I really had the most frustration with. But again, you're supposed to be testing my wisdom. How is this testing wisdom? Pathfinding skills? I don't know. I guess, considering that it took me a while to figure out how to actually get back to the goal. Because once you cross the, once you get past the mining facility entrance, it'll take you a while to figure out how to get back. All right, where to next? So, we got about 24 minutes to burn. So, any ideas what we should talk about in the meantime, other than Toho? Screw that. Why would we do that? You have Toho on for that. That's almost done. Yeah, well, what are you talking about? Well, then maybe you could, uh... I don't know. I'm actually thinking about doing one of the other ones as well, but I don't know how that's going to work. Which one? The Hoenn one? Uh, n no. There's a few I could try. It's just I gotta find them. Uh. But I've got three of them. Let me find them. Uh -huh. I'm thinking. You know, I... Well, since I got some downtime, whoa! Crap! Another world, Mercis Magic World, and World Blink. Which, I prefer not doing any of those. Yeah, Mercis <laughs> Magic World, as I recall, is a pseudo-Kaizo hack. Yeah. Don't remind me. Yeah, it's a pain in the blinkity-blink butt. Please, GM, don't remind us of Kaizo. <laughs> I mean, sure, I didn't have as much trouble, but still. Wait, what? Let's talk about Kaizo Blue. <laughs> what? Well, you're gonna see this a lot. But yeah, eventually, it wasn't until my last try that I actually figured out how to get back there. And I'm, I feel like such an idiot for not realizing such a simple thing. Um, so what's been going on with you guys since we last talked? Not much. Yeah. Well, as for me, I, I, I tend to oversleep a lot. Yeah. I know, it's not good for me. I know. Yeah. Would you believe I, in Final Fantasy IX, you know how... Difficult it is to get a high number of those nobles impressed in uh, during I want to be your canary. <laughs> I believe if you, if you get all hundred of them and Queen Bron impressed, you will actually get a moonstone that can teach you shell early on in the game, which is of course vital for a level one game, considering the black waltzes. Oh. Then again, I, would you believe? I was recently playing FF9. I actually got 99 nobles and the queen impressed. I, I was one off. There's always that one. Because in order to do the event perfectly, you must make sure you have both accuracy and speed. I think it was actually the closest I ever got to 100. Personally, then again, you also will need a moonstone for synthesis later. I I don't know. Perhaps after I finish seven, I'll probably do nine. And for you asking, well, no, it's not gonna be a hundred percent run. <sighs> Come on, computer. But seriously, hundred percent runs. Having a hissy fit. Hundred percent runs on Final Fantasy games is like asking you to tear your hair out. It's painful. And so is thinking of the sinks in. I mean, I would know. I've had hair pulled out, and it hurts. 
Oh, uh, that's not cool. They teleport with you. Whoa. And what? And and you and they and they uh. Trap me. Yeah. You can't clip through them. Nope. Uh, I confirm you are failed to pass the trial. Oh, to find, but then deliberately not pick up the most easily accessible tiers. Wow, for once that was actually useful. And look at that! They're marked on the map! Hmm... Once we've collected thus far. Maybe I'll do Emerald. Hmm. Speaking of Pokemon, eventually we gotta get back to Battle Revolution. Yeah. But that's not until we get some other runs done. Yeah, we do need to actually uh, empty the plate a little bit. Whoops. Once you get done with the Persona game, I think we could probably go back to Battle Revolution and finish it up. No, wait, no, we gotta do. We gotta finish up Eternal Darkness. Oh yeah. And gotta grab Selby. Yep. So I'm thinking, here's the order of priority. Crap. What? Nothing. Okay. Just noticing stuff for what I want to do. All right. Oh well. I'll go uh, for it. The ones that take priority is Persona and Skyward Sword. After that, will most likely be Battle Revolution and Eternal Darkness. Final Fantasy VII is on the low priority. <laughs> Yeah, you see this priority list? You see that really tiny fine print on the bottom? That's FF7. Yes. <laughs> oh, yeah, and there is a perforation right above FF7. Mm. Meaning that section is removable. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know me, I cannot get enough of insulting that overrated piece of crap. Of course. And the stupid Yowie Magnet's uh, protagonist. Uh, it's because people have way have way too much of an imagination. That's why. I'm not even gonna. There's a re there is a reason I was not even considered for the FF7 commentary. Because I know you would have torn it to hell. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, well, I don't mind if that. I had been on, if I had been on uh, the FF7 commentary, it would have turned into Mystery Science Theater 3000 Light. I wouldn't have minded that, though. Considering that, I was... I, I have... We do have actual fans of the game that watch us, Adam. I yeah. don't think they want to watch me in all of my snarky jack rip the game a new butt. <laughs> See, Inusakiya, you sun so at Sisakiya, Swimsuit, use water stone at <laughs> Say what? I think uh, I think she's talking about uh, These uh, are things oh. I could get in Emerald version. <laughs> oh, right. oh yeah, I remember. I remember. Yeah. Po uh, Tohomon Emerald is very quirky. Yes. Not, so not to mention not to mention difficult I hear. Oh, if I do exactly what I did with Tohomon Blue, I'll be fine. Won't have the GM. Yes. Because, um, yeah, uh, Toho Mon Blue, that run reeks of Cyber Sushi, aka Game Shark, so. Clyde and I are cheaters. We're not afraid to admit that. We don't play fair. Playing fair sucks. Hey! <laughs> what's wrong, what's wrong, with, what's wrong with playing fair, Christopher? Oh ho 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 ho! If you sound like my mother one more time, I'm going to slaughter this call by hanging up. I'm curious. What is wrong with playing fair? I'm asking a question. What's wrong with playing fair? It's restrictive. Now, in some in some genres, yes, playing fair is perfectly acceptable and enjoyable. But when it comes to hacks, you're crazy if you play fair. Hacks, true, but... You know, genuine games? No. Okay, I'll give you that one. I mean, I had to hack a Magnemite into Kaizo Blue that learned Flash, considering that you cannot get Flash in Kaizo Blue until you get Surf. And by then, mm. Flash is pointless. Yeah, the only reason I do, uh... Uh-oh. 
do stuff, so... Oh, that's so not cool. And it constantly raises up, too. The only reason I cheat nip is because, you know, but... Sorry, I'm not in the mood to play around while I'm trying to get my Toho's leveled up. Sorry, not happening. Look at that, it constantly raises and lowers. Oh, uh, crap. And it cutscenes you every freaking time. Not to mention you keep uh, running up on top of the thing. Uh-huh. Uh, go away! That works. Oi. Annoying piece of junk, isn't it? Mm-hmm. And again, it's a rusty. Yeah, I think we should do Tohomon Emerald. I'll have to test it out before I completely... Because I do want to make sure I know something of what I'm doing. True. Just basically, you know, what the hey. But, yeah, as I was saying, in terms of hacks, yes, it, it plays to not play fair. But, when it, again, when it comes to genuine games, no. For example, Zelda games. Because if you don't play fair, if you don't do anything right, you're going to get hammered for it. <laughs> I mean, yep. I mean, for example, um, Master Quest. That game is insanely difficult. I haven't seen much of it, but I've heard from people, it's difficult. So difficult, you can hardly get through the Dongo's Cavern. Oh, Master Quest? I've never gotten Master Quest. I, I haven't either, but I've heard stories about it. Oh, yeah, it is satisfyingly hard and ball-busting. Ugh. And do I really want that in my life? No. I wouldn't mind trying for the challenge. Uh, but then again, it's hard to find a copy. Uh, yeah, I mean, th th it was a limited release. Uh, I don't remember for what, but, I mean, getting that, getting, getting that, uh, getting that friggin', uh, getting a copy of that friggin' thing on eBay... I bet you anything, there's no way they're going for anything less than, than the original store price, if that. Well, then again, I, I, I looked online at the Last Stop CD shop in Sioux Falls, South Dakota, and apparently they do sell it for like $29.99 or $34.99. Oh, that's, that's, that's quite surprising. You'd, you'd think something that. You, you, you'd think a, a derivative of the best video game of all time would be worth a little more than that. Well. Times have changed. There have been other games since then, but... Well, no, something. Ocarina of Time has consistently been voted the best game of all time. It has not been dethroned yet. Yet. <laughs> I... At this point, I could have beaten this trial. I could have. But I couldn't figure out how to get back to the goal. In short, I got screwed over. Now you just gotta avoid the searchlights. But easier said than done. Oh crap. See, they just moved too fast. I'm like, okay, now how do I get out of here? I'm like, I'm trapped. <laughs> Fortunately, it was on my very last attempt that I actually finally got through this. That's okay, I'll may as well collect that. I'm gonna restart the trial anyway. Uh, seriously, I really hate the trials. <laughs> Why can't you use your sword? Like, there's no other way. I can't. I couldn't. <laughs> at this point, I was panicking because I couldn't figure it out. And uh, you re Oh. No. Instead, I'm going to get cleaved. Eventually. Because as tough as Link is, his spirit can easily be shattered by these guys. And they say he has an unbreakable spirit. 
Dead again. Dead again. Again. Link yes. one yes. point yes. oh. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> ah. Nope, no matter which way I go, I couldn't figure it out at that point. <laughs> Don't worry! On the very next try, I actually got it. I'm pretty sure, at least. Because it usually takes around 10 minutes to solve one of these trials. Um... Well, let's see. Um, yeah, I'm thinking next up on the docket for Zelda games is definitely gonna be Ocarina of Time. Sir. Once I can get the copy from my brother. He still hasn't fished the disc out for you? Of course not. It's in storage. <laughs> he's too lazy to go through the storage. Do you know where the storage is? No. Most well, likely in his basement. Pay him a visit when you can get a day off. Well, even if I did, he doesn't want to go through it. <laughs> that, well, I said pay him a visit so you can drag him down and help you. Well, the thing is, he has too much crap to sort through. That's my point. You get over there and you make him help you sort through the crap. Well, there's a problem with that. He He's too busy with his other job. And besides, he's planning to work for the state eventually. Oh, that, that, that'll that be lucrative if he lands it. Exactly. I was with the U.S. Census in 2010. That pays well. Federal <laughs> jobs pay very well. Not in the short term, but definitely in the long term. In the meantime, I am, uh, well, I'm running for my life, unsure what to do. It's kind of weird. It's usually the younger brothers who actually do better than the older ones. Yeah, believe me. <coughs> Sophie, what advice do you have for me this time? Yeah, I'm aware of that. Oh. Yeah, we figured that out. Well, that's she is correct. I did find all 15 tiers, now I know where to find them. <laughs> Holy crap, she's being useful? I think the imprison is about Scary. to come sealed again. Not until, <laughs> not until we get our epic sword. Ah. Yeah, just grab it and go. What are you doing, Katie? <laughs> I see you typing. I know. Uh, what are you typing? <laughs> um. <laughs> oh, I see. I see. That would be amusing. Oh, it's happening. In your Tohomon run, or roleplay rather, right? Yeah. <laughs> Worse. Cerno does not have her powers. Uh, ouch. <laughs> you know, if if she were in Persona, I bet she'd have Niflheim. Or you, know, you know, well, no, talk about, no, Niflheim is the ultimate ice technique. Yeah, that's obvious. <laughs> Let's see, her techniques. Uh, Bufu, Ma Bufu, Bufula, Ma Bufula, Bufudine, Ma Bufudine, and Niflheim. Oh, and Kokaitis, I believe. I think, I'm pretty sure Kokaitis is a skill. Mm. I think Margaret uses it? Yeah, Margaret's usually the one with the overpowered uh, persona abilities. In fact, she doesn't even need a persona to use them. She just fires them off because she's that freaking powerful. Being one of Philemon's agents. Yeah, oh, Kokaitis Pain. That's the one. Holy hell. Well, on the on the plus side, you're immune to fall damage while you're in here. That's true. She's got... Margaret's got Ragnarok, Meltdown, Niflheim, Kokaitis Pain, Thunder Rain, Narakami, Panta Ray, Divine Wind, Mind Charge, Power Charge, Dear Rahan, Megadolon, Morningstar, Hassel Tobe, Megadolon. Uh, again, which is afflicts 9,999. Yeah, and that's almighty damage, by the way. This stuff that only the final boss can resist. 
<laughs> that and uh, that and something that a magic mirror cannot block. Ouch. Um, but speaking of which, in the answer, when you do fight Yukari and Mitsuru, you, sh you should wait. You should wait. Don't don't go in there yet. Well, I'm just saying it's pretty obvious at this point. I mean, nobody's gonna watch this and then watch Persona. No, I mean, uh, don't go into the friggin' puddle. Oh, right. Well, anyway, as I was saying, I found this out the hard way when I first fought Yukari and Mitsuru in the answer. I used Makarakarn or Tetrakarn. They both use Mega Dolan. Oh! Cheap. And they both have Angelic Grace. Which is ah! evade magic. Screw that! In short, the game punishes you for trying to cheap them out. Yeah. I mean, they both use Megadol on one after another. Screw that! I'm like, how the hell did they learn that? Well, you waited. Yeah. That was smart. And there's another light fruit. Ooh, beacons! Yay! The beacons are lit. So we sound the trumpets, raid the drawbridge, and drop the automobile. No, we call for aid. The question is, will Rohan answer? No. Well, <laughs> Oh, I'm like such a nerd for doing that. No, what no, was it? Because they're really busy uh, dealing off the remains of Sauron's army. <laughs> well, Sauron, not Sauron. Sauron, rather, whatever. Anyway. Five or, five or tears to go. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it was either this trial or Din's trial that I really hated. Considering, you know, it's a volcano we gotta go into. And the volcano itself was very confusing to go through. Anyway. Find the cart, grab the tear, and... How am I supposed to grab Go over there. And I think that's when I... Eventually, I go back to where I was. It turns out, well, I, I go over to sand again, figuring out what, trying to figure out what I'm supposed to do, right? And I'm like, okay, there's no other way. I have to go the way I came. There's just no other way. Did I do it right? <laughs> Yes, yes, I did. Yeah, I don't think you should. Don't dash. Uh oh. Uh oh. I was about to say don't dash, but then again, they would hear you anyway, if you, whether or not you dash or not. Oh, great. Here we go again. <laughs> I'm like, okay, where else am I supposed to go? Well, eventually I found it. Oh, whoa! Not that way. Coming through the ground. Yeah, they phase right through it. That's cheating. They have no clip on. Well, what do you expect? They're hacking. Obviously, right? Well, they hack. They're hacking and slashing. R R R. Like, I already have that. Alright, yes. seriously, like, how am I supposed to get through this? And of course, yeah, I'm like, that's the only way. There's no other way. Okay. Uh, what? Oh, hey, Glide. Huh? Relevant pick in the chat. Wait, I'm like, wait a minute, wait, wait. Okay. I'm like, that's, yeah, that's where I finally figured that out. You can still run on walls when you're running <laughs> Screw that! But yeah, you, <laughs> seriously, I just that's when I finally found out. You can still run on walls when you're uh, on the sand. 
It's short. I got screwed over for no reason. Oh well. Now we don't need to worry because the two tiers are easily accessible. Well, anyway, what's this? Oh. I see. <laughs> Oh dear lord. Why? <laughs> oh dear lord, why? What? What? Oh, I have a reason. You'll find out. Okay. Wait, what? What? Uh, I'm testing something real quick while I have a moment. Mm. Anyway, uh. Hey, did you like the picky pick I sent you? <laughs> <laughs> yes, if you know what, if you know what's good for you, you'll shut up. What? What? The heck? Yeah. What's wrong? No, it's nothing. <laughs> She's freaked out. That's what. Yeah. Oh, not a. Oh, you better be sorry. Anyway. Yay. Let's move along. Agreed. I'm sorry, Clyde. I just couldn't help it. I saw it and it just... I don't know. Meh? That's alright. Alright, then. Now, let's say we actually end this trial. Yeah. Sorry, folks. It's just, what do you expect? I hate these trials. They're boring! We get here. <laughs> the claw shots. Both of them at once. They actually look a lot better than they did in Twilight Princess too. Yeah. Here we go. Ugh. Now then, shall we move on with the story? Yes. Ooh. I hope you're ready for not only uh, some sailing on the sand sea, but oh, also for a rehash boss. Oh, oh, she's that one. Yeah. Ooh. Now we can finally use those claw shot targets. Huh. Ah. I believe. Okay. And I believe you can actually uh, claw shot the flying. And claw chop off lines this time or not. Very useful. Bye bye. Into the si oh. Nope, not into the sand. Well, the, the long sword deals out twice as much damage. Well, yeah, you've got more blade to sink into an enemy, but. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 20 rupees. Dusk Relic. Okay. That works! Yeah. Alrighty. Okay, then. What's... What next? Oh! I see an opening. Oh, I see another area we haven't visited yet. In the, um, southwest. Excellent. Mark... Oh, yeah, there's also another place we have we have to check out, too. Now that we have the claw shots. I believe this will lead to... Oh! Tumbleweed! Saw a tumbleweed! <laughs> uh. Got it! Even that's a material? <laughs> yeah! That's, oh, that's, oh, that's, oh, that's, that's cool. Oh, that's right! You were asleep for that! Yeah, yep! I, thought, I probably crashed uh, during one of the previous... Uh... You, did. you did. We were like, wait a minute. What's going on here? We haven't heard from him at all. 
And, was, and then, figured, then we figured out, oh, wait, he went to La La Land. <laughs> yeah, what part was that? Uh... Yeah. Part six? Uh, yeah, most, most likely. I'm guessing! Oh, wait, no, part seven. Part eight was the one to death. Went to uh, the part seven. We went to the desert for the first time. Bye bye. Ugh. Ugh. Cannot unsee. Well, again, once you see it, you can't unsee it. Anyway, where are those beacons? There they are. And yes, people, I did get the hiding and shield, therefore, you, therefore, I won't have to worry about shield bashing or whatever. Which, which means, once I get the shield, I can actually defend without any effect. I mean, seriously, they wait until then to give you the best shield in the game. I like it better than Twilight Princess when you actually buy the shield. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> then again, I suppose. Fooling you. There we go. Huh? Then again, I suppose. Uh, ooh, hello there. Big guy. And Whoops! On them. Okay. Ah. It always happens when they when they spawn. They always shock you. Oh, really? Cool. Uh-huh. Would you care to fill the audience in? No. Okay. <laughs> They'll find out later. When yeah. we actually do it. Yeah. yeah. I'm still learning. Yes, for those of you who are just joining us on this channel, this is what we do when there's nothing really exciting to talk about on screen. We just casually talk about things. Mm -hmm. Because we're casual gamers. Heck yeah! I'm something of a mid-level pro on certain series. Certain series. Well, why else? I'm not a competitive player. Well, why? Well, this. Well, for any other series, I pretty much play casually. Especially with the Zelda games, I just play casually. Yeah, you're all business when it comes to so Resident Evil, huh? though. Yeah, I know. But other than that, I play games to have fun. But nowadays, I play games just to record them. <laughs> uh, eh. Anyway. Alright, where to next? Is there a path beneath me? Yes, there is. Oh, bye. <laughs> okay, uh... Yeah, our goal is to get to... Oh, first thing I want to get to a bird statue. Once I do that, I, we can check out what's in that goddess, ch goddess chest that we just opened up. There we go. Oh, I know, there's a tumbleweed that flew by. <laughs> yeah, they, they just randomly appear. When you least expect them. <laughs> but yeah, like I said, there's going to be a rehash of a boss as well as some sailing. Cool. Sailing without the sails. Swapping out my deck, swapping out my deck. <laughs> Speaking of decks, I actually got lucky with Tetra Master in Final Fantasy IX. Got some rare cards early on. Get rid of this not useful fairy deck anymore. Since most of them are banned or. Bad Konami, bad! <laughs> Konami's doing better than Crapcom. Yeah, but they're annoying the Yu-Gi-Oh players. Which, that's okay. I have a six Sam's deck that's awesome now. And my Light Sworn deck. Uh. Alrighty. Eventually, I do capture some sand cicadas so that I can actually get, uh, well, some itchy stuff. Oh yeah, I think there's also another uh, ch chest around here somewhere. You need claw shots for. Oh, 
hello there. Oh, you don't want to play? Oh. Nope. It wants to hurt. Well, I do not. Well, then I will do the hurting. Mm. Do the what? The masochist. The hurting. <laughs> oh, it's Tenshi. Yeah, it's Tenshi. <laughs> you thought you'd get away without too many references. Well, then again, we're kind of yep. bored. Hey. Yep. Okay. Yes, Emerald looks interesting so far. <laughs> so wait, where is Tenshi? Huh? Where? Why are you mentioning Tenshi? You mentioned Tenshi. And eh, twenty rupees once again. <laughs> wait, when? When I said somebody's being a masochist. Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna say the claw shot's got some good range. Uh... <laughs> and you're almost as bad as somebody else I know in terms of when it comes to laughing. <laughs> I just think this is hilarious. Oh, another goddess cube. Huh? Here we go. I slice through like butter. Well, I can't believe it's not butter. <laughs> In fact, I can't believe it. Considering that it was, it was steel. Okay. Let's not start with that again. <laughs> <laughs> I can go complete blues clues and go get my magenta plushie. <laughs> and look, another boblet. Yes, folks, you heard right. He's blocking the way. Oh, you don't have to screw you. Uh, I don't have to deal with you. Bye! Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> well, I just grazed that and I still got hit. I, I didn't even... Well, when you get too close to the bullets, you don't get the graze points. Then again, yeah. Then again, then again, there's, no, <laughs> then again there's no point score anywhere here. Oh. Here we go. Oh, that was relatively uh, famous. We could just claw shot back up there. Bye bye. Wait. Oh wait, it's that way. Okay. Oopsies. Wrong way. Well, I might as well see what's over here. <laughs> Ooh, 20 pieces. Pain. <laughs> okay, nothing over here. Alright. Did hurt to check. Except those Octoroks we just killed. Which reminds me, I gotta do editing eventually. Uh huh. Keyword. Eventually. <laughs> Alright. Let me guess. Uh, a victory road? No. We uh, skipped it. Uh-huh. We did it off screen because I got lost. Anyway, we're in caves. Ooh, plenty of bomb flowers. Hey, it's it's another Toron. There we go. Ooh, there's even there's even blessed butterflies here too. Wait a minute. Okay. Hello there. And it's not a troll. Hey. Ooh, an evil crystal. Nice. Yukari decided to quit trolling Link for right now. A dragon loves putting the abilities of those who visit him. Like, what? Yes. what? What are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> what, the Yukari hell? what are you talking about? Yukari just. What did I just drop? Oh, that box. <laughs> Yukari decided to stop trolling Link for right now. Uh. Yeah. But in any case, uh, we just got something interesting. We, we got a hint about uh, the Thunder Dragon. <laughs> oh. So thus, now we have the whip. The Thunder Dragon? All you gotta do is find Sailor Jupiter, and she'll show you the Thunder Dragon. Well, then again, <laughs> then again this is a different kind of Thunder Dragon. Uh... Golo! 
Gotta love it when somebody has all these references ready. Well, <laughs> well we do also have a fire dragon. But then again, I don't remember that at all in the show. No, because that was a phoenix. Mm -hmm. A sacred flame. Ooh. Sweet Goro, I remember now. Wait, do we have to burn bells in this sacred flame? No. Thank God. And if anybody gets that, you deserve a cookie and some mental rehabilitation. Okay. Hey, thank you. Ooh. Good luck to you. Huh. It's called Deadly Towers. Did oh, see Crab and Madam Ooh. Luna play that at one point? And the Look at that! We're recovering health while he's talking! That's funny. I guess sitting is a free action. Well, and so speaking, Ooh. though. Okay. Alright, then. Yeah, ten rupees is a drop in the bucket. There's lots of ancient ruins there. Sleeves. Okay. And there we go. Wait a minute. Are we going into another dungeon already? Wait a minute. No, we're not. Not yet, anyway. But yeah, we got one uh, B button item left to grab. A report, Master. I don't want to report. I want you to go away. Ah, uh, so this is the sand scene. Wow. This is what will become the Gerudo Desert. And the port, they get to the sea. What sea? <laughs> it, was, uh, it was a sea. Yeah, I'm saying what sea? Anyway, now I I, did, I read that there was actually two silver rupees above me. However, um, it's tricky. Okay, there's no uh, bird statue right here. There is one down there. So, but yeah, I I had to go out of my way to try to collect those silver rupees. But you do that, you'll need a fully upgraded beetle. Um. So yeah, it doesn't really work out that well. Mm. Saying that, you gotta be picture perfect, pixel perfect. <laughs> anyway, uh, wow, this place is rather spacious. Now I'm getting some Wild Arms vibes from this music. There we go. Oh, whoa! Hi. Uh -huh. Hi. Where the hell you come from? Behind me. He wanted to just say hello and give you a little hug. I don't want a hug. But he wants a hug. Why won't you give him a hug? No. <laughs> no, 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 no. This is the wrong type of flag. No. Ah. Oh, that had to suck. Oh. Ah. Yeah, this is not the flan. This is not the flan you give hugs. This is the flan that eats. Oh. Ooh. Or eats. There we go. Yeah, there's actually is water somewhere. It's hard to find though. Up, oh, the other ones are gone. Oh well. I got ten of them anyway. Yeah, you need to upgrade that bug net. I will eventually. 
by the time I, uh, recently, last time I recorded, I had the bug net upgraded. Uh, uh, how many times can you upgrade an item? Like, it, uh, it depends on, um, how many times it can be upgraded. Uh, the bug net has one upgrade, that's just double its size. Uh, the bow can be upgraded twice. The sock, the slingshot can be upgraded once. The sacred shields can usually be upgraded twice. Can and you upgrade the Highland shield? There's no point. I'm saying, can you? No. It's as strong as strong can be. Oh! Yeah, that was. <laughs> Use the boost to get through! Already did yes, that. Did. Anyway, we're back at the bazaar because I think I think we need to upgrade the beetle. Because I do try to grab those two silver rupees. Hey, Gondo. Hey. Yeah, that's upgrade. <laughs> All right. Oh, good. We have just enough stuff. Hmm. Go on my back here. Go for it. Okay. okay. Happy meal. No. Uh -huh. Is that a happy meal? <laughs> no, we don't. No, I don't want to no, know. No, Link gets a Mighty Kids meal. Nice! So, what does the beetle do now? It, it goes faster, and we can further upgrade it. To do? To go f even... To, to, to last longer. Okay! To cover a much longer distance. Here we go. This now, time he's making a Whopper. Mm-hmm. Or maybe a Whataburger. <laughs> <laughs> the tough beetle. If you got anything else you want to figure around with, just let me know. All right. Nope. Nothing at the moment. Ooh. Come again soon. You hear? <sighs> I'm like, is there anything else I need eventually? I do come back later on to get a heart push and double double plus. Mm. Those are like <gasps> an awesome healing item. A double plus yeah. heart potion? Well, let's just say that uh, you can recover your health twice. <laughs> full health. Yes. Means two helpings of full health restore. Ooh, there's two chests we can find. Do 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 do. Alright. Well, I'm thinking about it. Oh? Need to look something up. Oh, yeah, Bamboo Island. You can cut a piece of bamboo. Depending on how many how many slices you cut the bamboo with before it falls to the ground, you get rewarded with a treasure. It only costs 10 rupees per try. In fact, Petrus' father is, runs the bamboo clean cut minigame. And let's just say he gets very suspicious about his daughter. To the point where he asked you to probably to find out who's flirting with Beatrice. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't know it though. But off camera, I actually fulfilled the side quest. I got five gratitude crystals from her and made her very happy. Hmm. Sorry, Peter. I hope, I hope she does realize that uh, Link is with Zelda, right? Well. But then again, this is a this is a, this is a, during a time where there's no ill effects for two timing, I suppose. You're just pulling stuff out of your bum at this point. I know. I mean, I mean, it's just like, it's just like in the Persona games, you know? You can hop from one girl to another without any ill effects once their leaks are maxed. Because then you don't have to worry about them going reverse or broken. Ooh, water. Hmm. Which reminds me, E4, I'm probably just going to be gr friends with all the girls except one. Really? I don't know who yet. 
Uh, just a note, Adam, if you're going to make that one eye, don't immediately go for the dating option. I wasn't. I wasn't. Actually, no, I wasn't thinking of I. I was thinking of Yumi. Oh, the little uh, chibi instrument? No, the, uh... that's Ayane. I'll talk about, uh, talk about Drama Club. Ah. Drama Club's annoying anyways. Well, I don't know. Well, what can I say? I like Yumi better than Ayane. Hey, what we get? I don't blame you. I don't have a heart medal. Hmm. Why, well, Avenger, keep this with you. What's our Avenger Palace like, I wonder? Probably full, probably st stock full. Alright. Oh, it is full. Yes, I got all eight pouches. Yay! I might need that. Huh? Epic picture! Okay. Um. What? Where? Okay. Ah. Oh, Mia! Yes! It's epic, isn't it? Yes. <laughs> All, right, <yeah. laughs> All right then, let's go find out. Got a match. Yes. Yeah, eventually I do go back to Skyloft to get myself uh, the heart potion. Yeah, it's right over there. In fact, now that we have the claw shots, we can actually get. Uh, there's actually a, a, a small island with three chests with inside them. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's three chests. <laughs> But to get them, you will need the claw shots. In fact, now that we have the claw shots, we can actually do this, a side quest with the potion shop infuser. Cool. Uh, we gotta look for his baby's rattle. Eh. Well, I will be right back for a moment. Okay. Well, we're on our own now. Just the guys. Great. Sausage convention. That's okay, I don't swing that way. You first to get through! Alright. So what are treasures are we gonna grab today? Trust me. You're gonna see uh, plenty of uh, weird stuff in this part. Like I said, we gotta go on sailing on the sea. Without a sail. Huh. I know, sounds confusing, doesn't it? Yeah, once we're done with this part, I gotta send Katie more footage. Mm. This, is the last, this is the most recent one I sent her. But yeah, I'm thinking of uh, making Yumi uh, the girlfriend. Mm. Which means I'll have to max out her social link before summer vacation. Because she only goes with you to the summer festival when you're at rank one, two, or max. I don't know. Which did you prefer, Yumi or Ayane? Mm. Honestly, I prefer Yukiko. <laughs> I'm talking about the two sun girls. Hmm. Ayane is good for getting more social skill boosts. But, in terms of the storyline, I like for Yumi. So you're helping her, uh, deal mm. with her, um, issues with her parents. Hmm, yes. Yeah, I, I could... Anyway, uh... There we go. Like, where is the... Oh, I see vines down there. Ah. Whoops! I meant to just drop down the ledge. But yeah, as I mentioned before, the blade looks very familiar. The size is familiar. Of the sword? Yes. Hmm. That is in here. Hot piece? No! It's another life medal! Hmm. Cool! Which means and it brought me back uh -oh. to life. we gotta go back to the item check. Yeah. So there's an excuse to go back to Skyloft. Yeah. How many life medals can you? How many medals can two. you equip? Two. two. There are only two of them in the game. Which means if you don't collect the life medals, you will not be able to max out your health. 
because there's only 24 heart pieces and six heart containers. Yeah, the only game that has less dungeons is uh, Majora's Mask. Mm -hmm. Hey, who are these guys? Patrolmen. Ah. What's up, guys? Uh, not much. How about you? Oh, saving the world, killing monsters. All days work. I mean, sure, sure. Whee! Whoops. Smart. Real smart. Yeah, I know. Anywho. Well, let's go grab that life battle so we can have a total of 15 hearts. Okay. I think, I think at the present, my max health is 18 hearts. That's with the life medals. So if I was a little bit more persistent, I could have gotten every single heart piece. Mm. But then again, this ain't 100% run. Yeah. I'm just playing it for fun. <laughs> so let's see how Beatrice is doing. Hi there! Oh. Yes, please! Alright, uh, I think I'll get rid of one of my heart medals. For a life medal! And... Is that gonna be it? Maybe. Maybe not. I'm thinking. Nope, that's it. <laughs> Bye! Alrighty then. Okay. Oh, here we go. Yeah, not, see, when they have a little prompt above their heads, that means they have new things to talk about. Alright. Bottoms up! <laughs> sure. Okay, uh... Whoops. <laughs> Welcome. <sighs> I should be second front of customer. We should have been able to sleep at night. Again. <laughs> Hello, welcome to our little side business. Uh huh. Sure. I assume that's a side quest, helping him out. <laughs> yeah, it is. Ooh, pleasant butterfly, wooden rhino beetle, and volcanic ladybug. <laughs> Stirring, stirring, stirring. Here you go. Now it's a heart potion plus. Uh, yeah, sure. Can we upgrade even further? Oh, we need one more blessed butterfly. Fortunately, there's some outside. So let's go grab one. Yes. Since apparently the ones out here don't give you any um, gossip stones or goddess walls. Again, they're just red herring. And notice, the music uh, kind of tones down whenever you have to bug that out. Weird. Okay. Where are those butterflies? Oh wait, they're right down there. Whee! And I got you. All right, look at that. We got one of everything in the collection menu. Well, uh, in nice. Terms of, in terms of the raw materials, that is. <laughs> Bugs, not so much. We still need one, one species of bug. That's a sand cicada. Well, we know where to find them. We know where to find them, but the problem is trying to catch them. Mm. All right. Uh, uh, dude, I'm facing this way. All right. Yeah, it's just something I like to do. Okay. There we go. Now we have enough. Oh wait, I guess we did have the sand cicadas. We had one. Okay, we're okay. Then, oh wait, there is another bug we're missing. Oh, it's not the Xanakatus. 
Heart push and double plus. <laughs> okay. If I remember correctly, it's most likely a starry firefly. Hmm. Those are going to be found at night. Alright. Well, let's get out of here. Okay, uh, where are you going? Oh, yeah, I'm collecting hearts. <laughs> Hey, Fletch! <sighs> yeah, I, I helped him out by giving him a stamina potion. <laughs> He's trying to work out. Does he need stamina? Lots of it. Yeah, because he wants to be tougher. There we go. Got one. And... Two. Looks like the third one hightailed it. <laughs> no, I decided I already caught it. There we go. <laughs> All right then, let's go back to the desert. We're fully prepped up and ready to go. And trust me, that heart push into a plus, I use that. I'm, I'm pretty sure for either a boss fight. I'm pretty sure I used it for the imprisoned. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's for imprisoned round two. Either that or another boss. Alright. Alright, let's... Let's dive already. What is that progress meter over there on the uh, left? That's your altitude meter. Yep. Mm, that's what I thought. And... Here we are. Okay. Here we are, the ancient harbor. And a good thing, good is for automatic parachutes. I'm like, okay, uh, let's okay. put the new toy to work. Unfortunately, I think if you speed boost, it takes longer to do. Or it, it, it runs out of stamina faster. Yep. That was also close to the exit. Yeah, there are silver rupees up there. So I decided to check it out. Whoops! <laughs> derp. There's no bridge there! <laughs> derp, derp, derp. Oh well. Ah, there's claw shot targets though. Ooh, I hear cicadas. Let me see, I'm loving the music in this area. Let's see, uh, claw shot. And there we are. Now, the tough beetle. There are, yeah, there are silver rupees up there. It's, again, it's extremely tricky to grab them. Fortunately, you might run out, of, you're gonna run out of stamina even before you even collect them. They're just there to tease you. I'm, so they're not, uh, they're not obtainable? Apparently not. Although, I did see claw shot targets on the top of those pillars. Huh. Where? I didn't see them. When the beetle was over exploring right at the beginning, I saw claw shot targets on top of the pillars. So, uh... There they are! Yeah, I mean, you're. Sp I think you're supposed to climb up on top of the uh, pillars and send the uh, beetle straight. Really? What? I didn't see any shot. I didn't see any targets. On the other side. Pretty sure they were there. Nope. Can't get them. 
So I, I think I give it one more try. Ah, lens flare. <laughs> lens flare. But nope, just proving that they're up there. So eventually I just give up. Oh, man, though, it, it is a lot more sturdier than before. Alright, yeah. There you go, folks. Some riches that you cannot grab. Except if you. I'm pretty sure one of those has a target on the top of it you can grab. Then again, at the point I'm at in the game, I don't need those ru rubies anyway. <laughs> He's saying I'm pretty close. I think I'm pretty close to the end of the game anyway. Hmm. <laughs> Alrighty. Now they're. Oh! Joy! Yeah, there's, there's a goddess cube nearby. I guess I find it later. Oh! A robot! Okay. Yeah, yeah I'm like, how am I gonna give out there? Oh, well, might, might as well hit it. I'm stone. Hey there! And. the time stone sinks! Because it's powering the unit. Mm -hmm. Hey there. Who am I? Oh, uh, Nehru's flame. Uh oh, he's like, um, uh, it was the day of the storm. My crew and I were diving in the seas as usual. Those brutes, the pirates suddenly attacked us. Oh, that sucks. Yeah, his ship was holding the flame. Oh, no. The ship itself is a dungeon. <laughs> mm. It haunts me wondering where my ship could be. I bet, I bet my hat would turn the ship invisible. Wait, invisible? Ah, it has... Ah, it's camouflage. Yes, I do. Alright. Sure thing, Skipper. I'll help. Alright. Hmm. There's something weird about that map of yours. You need a proper C chart. <laughs> uh, Wait, what? We gotta grab the C chart from his home. Shall we shove off? Let's go! Mm. Fetch quest! Yes. Mm. Hey, at least we go sailing. <laughs> on a boat? Yes, we're on a boat! <laughs> Ooh, and we can actually defend ourselves with a cannon. Fire! Hey, this is cannon. sounding familiar. <laughs> yeah, it's like Wind Waker. <laughs> Darn! Thought it was Danmaku cannons. Nah. Let's go. Huh? <sighs> no, it's Freeman's mind cannons. <laughs> <laughs> Anyway, yes, we gotta go to where I put that beacon, and it's well. Yeah, we gotta climb a lot of claw shot targets just to get to the skipper's retreat. Yes, and don't leave the boat. Would be kind of bad. It's cool. Hey, this is like a sand sea. This is really like FF12. Yeah. Cutscene activates power! Skipper's retreat. This ain't the dungeon. Our goal is to get up there. We've arrived, right? Okay. What else are we looking for? 
Ah, the very top. The sea chart we need is in my shack. You're the one who had to go get it. Yeah, because he doesn't have what it takes to fight the monsters. Plus, they don't want to have to deal with the uh, implications of him walking outside of the time, sto uh, time stone's uh, aura. Yeah. Looks like we got because zip. ultimately, you're going to have to leave this guy behind. Eventually. Okay. Oh, another one. No. All right. Claw shots and yay! Oh, great. No, don't have time for you. Boom. Piats! Hey, they're back. Yay. And there's no claw shot targets. Yay! Oh, like, okay, where else do I go this time? Don't touch the bomb flower cactus. Otherwise, oh, there's a chest down there. We'll get that did, later. Did uh, did your uh, ridicule actually uh, flash when you went over the chest? No. No, it didn't. Nope, you cannot claw shot to the chest. We'll have to, we'll have to take a leap of faith to get it. Hmm. Nope, can't get it. Can't get there to where we're at right now. Yep. Oh. But yeah, basically we gotta take a dive off the very top. Oh jeez. Hey yes. Glide. Uh? Glide, it's like the bards leap all over again. Oh dear. Why? You know what part of Skyrim I'm referring to, don't you? Yes. Uh, I see rocks yeah. up there. To be honest, I used the Become Ethereal shot for that jump. Uh. <laughs> Ooh, what's in here? What's Something the passage? Long enough to go off. <laughs> Surprise! Crap! <laughs> no. Ah, here we are. Like I said, there there is a rehashable boss in this in this in this part. Okay, what's up here? Ooh. Oh, more ants. Eh, don't need them. More ants. Oh, Grand Mobner with an iron shield. Oh, gr ow. No way to make him throw that away. A metal shield Mobner. Mobner. Oh, yeah. I can't get 85% chance you could climb over that large shield as if it were a wall. So we have to disable Z-targeting. Yeah, like that. Ah. Or you can strafe him. There we go. Thank you. And for profit. Okay. Nope, can't dive from there. And look at that, we got zip lines. No, Baba, no. Enjoy. <laughs> Open. 20 rupees. Yeah, there's yeah, there's zip lines right here. Look. 
Okay, and... Oh! Hi there! We need the whip! It's a pea hat! Whoa! Cutscene and vulnerability! Whoa! That's fortunate. <laughs> Screw you. Bye bye. bye bye! Okay. There it is. Ooh, yep, there's okay. something down there. If I had to wager a guess, that is a goddess circle. No, well, actually, I don't think so. It's probably just a red herring. Ah, here we go. Oh, what? What the? Oh! <laughs> oh! <laughs> yes! That is awesome. That is a jerk move, but it's funny. I wasn't. Ex I was not expecting that. <laughs> that is such a jerk move, but that is hilarious. <laughs> I know. Oh. Get down here. <laughs> I'm on fire! I know, I'm not doing it right, I don't care. Well, it seems to be doing well for these guys. Alright. There we go. Bye bye. Hmm. All right. You'll notice it's actually playing a a slow version of Nehru's Wisdom right now. Yeah. Anyway. All right. Hook. There we go. There we are. Now, let's take a look what's outside here. I hear cicadas. They buzzy! Very buzzy. So buzzy, they may as well be beetles. <laughs> gotcha. No, no bug is harder to catch. Because oh. no bug is rarer. <laughs> oh, wait. I don't think we're, we're missing one. Oh, wait. I think I know we're missing. We're missing the foreign grasshopper, actually. Because you keep making them fall into the water. Eh. Whoa. Huh? We need the gust billows. <laughs> uh, no, Fee, I'm tired. Uh, That's why. No. Huh. There's okay. a time stone in here. We're going to have to turn it on. Nope. Or we could just do this. Okay. Well, I mean, if we want to wake up those robots, we need a time uh, stone. No, we, we can't. We don't need no time stone. You really shouldn't open all the people's cupboards without permission. Really, game? Alright. Ah, an ember relic. Hmm. Yoink! Oh, hi. Are you kidding me? That uh, would be a phone. <sighs> Before the CD comes, I come to the desert sand. Alright. Music. Ooh, pretty. A skipper, a skipper sheet chart. Oh. Okay. 
Ah, that's a ship. <laughs> We're gonna get to the ship's captain spent many happy days among his many crew members. Anything else we can uh, uh, blow? No. Yeah. <laughs> Wow, that was unexpected! You know, the goddess blue. Oh. Wait, that Amaretta just appeared out of nowhere. Okay, we're out of here. Let's see. Wait. I'm looking, yeah, I'm trying to look exactly where I'm supposed to dive. Wait a minute, that's a mistake! Too late. <laughs> Ugh. No! Screw off! <laughs> and disintegrate. What is it? Got a skew over there. Uh, oh, very, very go. All right, here we are. All right, charge up. Boom. Ning. That's one more chest we can unlock later. I'm like, oh. That's why I realized I gotta go, whoop, nope. Doesn't work that way. Can't skydive from here. I'm like, okay, well. Then I realized I had to go back up to the to Skipper's Retreat. And actually skydive from up there. Mm. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, I was like looking at the map, seeing how was I supposed to get up there? <sighs> oh, yeah, did I mention that we also get something fun out of this? Oh, oh really? Yes. It's fun yet tedious. Those two words do not mix ever. <laughs> I guess not. <laughs> So yeah, gotta make our way back up. <sighs> it could be work. It could be worse. It could've it could've been worse. I could have done this from the very beginning. Instead we're doing it from the halfway point. I don't have time for this. Editing, my friend. Editing. This was this was a while ago, all right. I've already uploaded it. Sorry, over and done. I'm just, I'm just saying. Yeah. Wait, wait, whoa! Remember when huh? next time? We remember something? What? <laughs> I thought I would have despawned or something. No. <laughs> Why are you telling me that when it's postcom anyway? It already happened. Uh. What's the point of warning me? Oh, you almost caught it. Oh well. really don't like it's moving clash on targets. This is the clutch shot will only fire in a straight line. Yeah, 
Yeah, let's look down. No, not that way. Ah, it's this one right here. Here we go. A leap of faith. That works. Now, what do you risk my life for? A silver ripping! I don't feel like a celebrity. <laughs> Let's have a ball for a short. Especially since uh, you can only get 20 rupees from treasure chests as well as high end enemies. Yeah, it is playing a uh, slow, melancholic version of Nehru's Wisdom. I didn't recognize it. Bye. What? Okay, we're done. Yeah, don't th I don't think you can hook sh uh, claw shot them. <laughs> oh, that sucks. Oh well. Since I got a goddess cube unlocked, might as well see what's up here. I wonder if it's worth it. It better be worth it. First off, where is it? Map! Wait, what am I doing? Why am I going... Oh wait, I guess I'm... I guess I was just doing that to mark it up. Uh, Oh wait, here we are. Okay. Wait, wait. Eventually, I did find uh, the chest. I think it's actually in Skyloft. What the hell are you doing? Well, I couldn't find it on the map, so I was like, might as well go back. Alrighty then, let's go. Look at that! The skipper knows where we're going. <laughs> There's also another goddess cube somewhere around here. Where could it be? Ooh. That was a... Ah! Here's something. Aha! What's in here? Oh, whoa! Hello, small fry. <laughs> Another one? <laughs> yes! Go away! You seriously need some Notori brand bug spray. Yes! Or time shift stone. That way we can revert these guys to nothing. Back to eggs. No, it would have put them back to nothing. It wouldn't have existed in like a thousand years. True. Unless that is the time frame. No. I, can't, I don't know. I don't know. It's never explicitly said. Is that a surprise? A long time. For an ocean to turn into a desert. Hmm. A long time. Okay. Ah. All right. So we gotta go there next. The shipyard. Couldn't we just sail around in the sea until we crash into it? No. Then we... It might... What if it suddenly damaged... What if it suddenly set off the stone? If it set... If that set off the stone, then, uh... We would have no way of actually hitting it again, considering it's below deck. Hey. 
in any case. All you gotta do is just follow the beacon and then... Yeah, this is what we have to do for this part of the game. Sail across the entire sand sea. Sadly, it's not that kind of sea. <laughs> this ain't great, trust me. Yeah, you gotta go around to the other side of the atoll. That's yes. not quite the other side of the atoll. I was, yeah, I was consulting my map, and then I was like, wait, it's shallow enough, I should be able to just, you know, get through there. Oh well. Here we are. The shipyard. Oh, great. Tracks. Mm. Oh, boy. I, 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 like, I, I like where this is going. There's all the town where the workers left. The building's a construction bay. But it's locked. Each location on the island is linked to by a minecart track. Really? Alrighty. I can see where this is going. Oh, yes. If we didn't see where this was going, there'd be problems. Great, we need the bow to stop things from knocking the cart off the track. Huh? No. <laughs> I was thinking minecart madness. That too, possibly. Uh, besides, we have to we have to use our own body to keep the cart from crashing. The Zoppos! Oh, hi! Whoa! They use the exact same attack! That was cool. Bye bye. I hack off your tail. Yoink! It's a little gross, but you never know when you might need one. <laughs> Whoa! Was that a short you kid? <laughs> it was! Yeah, I bet. I suggest just hack, randomly hacking. Oh, bye bye. Oh, that lizard tail's gone. Yeah, ever since I hold it with the Stalfos, I'm kind of hesitant to use my shield mm. at this point. Let me just rear end of my seat, but me! Got it! Sorry. Whoops. <laughs> he sit back down. Oh. Nice. All over the place, uh huh? Some safety information about using the cards posted on the wall over there. I should give that stuff a quick read. Yeah, Goran seem very, very uh, disconnected from each other. Mm-hmm. Well, they're nomadic. Press speed to slow down. Seem to be remote upwards to jump over obstacles. Oh boy. Oh great. Alright. It's a roller coaster! More or less. Down, 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 down. Eee! It'll randomly speed up too. So it's not minecart madness, it's a uh, killer coaster. Works for me! Uh huh. Ah! <laughs> Not cool. Oh, I'm going to scream at this. Yeah, you will. 
you also scream at what's coming up. Wait for it. Wait for it. As long as it's not spider to the face, I'll be okay. No, it's not. It's just oh, it's, it's oh wait. Good, we've reached the halfway point. We're safe for now. We yeah, we reached a checkpoint. That was the easy part. Oh hi. Alright. Huh, okay. Um oh something over there. Oh the zip line. No thanks. Mini scorpions. Maracas. The construction bay. Here's the hard part. Oh, wow. <laughs> Do a little jig. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's funny. I like with what I was just told in the name chat. That's funny. Uh, well, yeah, you gotta lean to switch tracks. Ugh. And that's not the only hard part. That's not the only hard part. The other hard part is this. You gotta jump. Oh, screw that! <laughs> Saw that coming. I, it was right there in the control notes. You have to jump at some point. Uh, I wasn't paying attention to that. Because someone just called me capable. Uh, said that I had capable hands. It's like, wait, what? Since when? <laughs> capable hands? Yes. I don't see how that would benefit anyone other than Zero. <laughs> I am on a roll today. Oh, I was in a group chat with my friends on DeviantArt. I kept zinging this one poor girl like all over the place. Oh my! Oh my gosh! <laughs> well, the only reason they're pu they're pushing me towards it is because you know I'm a Toho player, and they're wanting to do an AU. Which the AU kind of scares me, but makes me squeal at the same time. Do uh, explain. AU Yuka. What? Ugh. Um, Yuka's already a little what? Quite, oops. Quite dangerous enough. What kind of AU are they talking about? Cerno and her are friends. Oh, that's perfectly fine. Well, and it changes some of the some of the games around, so. Oh, now this is tricky. I failed at this a few times. Yeah, well, I wouldn't be surprised. You'd have tr you'd have problems too. Well, I I have no experience with the Wii Motion Plus, so yeah, that's a given. Uh, what? If anything, I have a feeling I'd probably be mashing B a lot and overcompensating. <laughs> What's with the random speed boosts? Uh, uh, uh. Uh, yeah, this is the tricky part. You gotta jump. <laughs> yes, please don't hit the X's. The X's are bad. Yeah. The X's mean closing minecart.exe. The last two jumps are tricky. Or you go right into a mob spawner. Or worse, an ender portal. Oh, nether. Uh, no, nether doesn't send you to the nether instantly. Oh, it doesn't do that anymore, that's right. An ender portal will send you to the end instantly, though. Oh, there we go. Here, where it gets fast. Well, get that. Uh, you have a break button. <gasps> well, how did that happen? You okay. leaned too far. No, it was. It was also going too fast. Like I said, you have a break button. They were probably trying to force you to use it there. Yeah. Do. 
So yeah, thus this my card really frustrates me. Hmm. <laughs> I just can't seem to find the timing to do that. That's mm, difficult. You'd have problems too. I haven't touched the game since you know the last time I played. <laughs> Good little jig. I've been busy with plots and events. And work. Mostly work. Uh-huh. Uh... Lead to the right! <laughs> I'm sorry, just... just uh, my cards like this make me nervous. Oi. Oi. I'll be over here. Alt tab. Uh, <laughs> okay. And here we go again. Seriously, what's with the random speed boosts? Because it feels like it. Boy. Whoa! That was a bit too close. But yeah, it's the last jumps that are the most tricky. Whoa! Okay. Yeah, which what do you see when we get to the last jumps? <laughs> mm, not sure I want to. Oh, you'll see. You'll see. They're right over there. Do not want. <laughs> mm -hmm. Whoa. Whoa. One turn not, you're gonna get. Now mash that B button. Yeah, I was like, uh, okay. Whoa. Whoa! Here we go. Here we go. Coming up. This is gonna hurt. Yeah, like, it happens without any warning. Ugh. Look at that. Look how narrow those jumps are. Oh my gosh. Forget that. Here we go again! I think that only, only... Oh, I'm supposed to bring, bring my phone. Be right back. <laughs> Phones. That was just the wrong number. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it's those last two jumps that I really hate. They're evil. Not as evil as the imprisoned round two. At least you get back up there. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Whoa! Brakes! Dodge! Oh great, here it comes. What the? What? Whoa, I made it! I'll take it. Oh, it's getting ready to storm outside. Oh, cool. By the All way, all of a sudden I heard thunder. It's like what the? Oh yeah. By the way, we made it. 
Yay! Woo. Now what's in the construction bay? Uh. Hmm. Okay. Whoa, it's big. The structure is filled with sand. So we gotta go digging, huh? What well, doesn't hurt to search every nook and granny? Yeah, how deep is this gonna go? <laughs> I have no idea. I'm a... Never mind, I'm not even. What? I was gonna do I'm a dwarf and I'm digging a hole, but you know, it's. Ah! <laughs> kind of pointless. Ooh, spinny rippy! Mm -hmm. Spinny, 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 spinny. Huh? What's this? Oh. Wow! Um. That's... You again. And now you're a mini boss. <laughs> mini boss music. <laughs> the circus has come to town. Oi. You're much weaker now that I have a stronger sword. Whoa! Nice miss. Stupid. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, shoot. <laughs> Squishies! Go away! Like I, mean, I said, you theoretically, Link could actually stab into the, the gap he between could. the two claws. One more should do it. Aha! <laughs> there you are. Aha! Where are you? Being annoying? Yeah. Um, he's almost completely uncovered. How is he hiding? Go on. Ah, two hearts of damage! Ow! Owie! Yeah, you are- you are now... ...fodder. <laughs> this is what you get for copy and paste. Bad, 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 bad. <laughs> Monsters Lim. nest. I now estimate the chance of finding clues in sand is is extremely low. So in short, we d we should just move on. This was their excuse. In short, this was a complete waste of time. <laughs> they just wanted to throw in a minecart level. Yeah. That's pointless. <laughs> All right. There only leaves one place left to go, according to Skipper. Nope. Oh, one place left. The stronghold of the pirates. Let's go. Anchors away. Ideally, we should do it without using the boat, because then they're dead, and we can just, uh, dig up the, uh... Oh, a mechanical maniac. 
You will have to take a ship back. We have no choice. Ah, it's over there. Of course, given he is a machine and an evil machine, likely in the service of Jerahim, he's probably the boss is probably still functional. Tighten up wherever you humans have instead of bolt, so let's get going. <laughs> 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 uh, present company accepted, of course. Considering, you know. No, I'm just. <laughs> That's derby, I know. No, I'm tempted to say something, but I won't. I'll be good. Okay. Say it. No. Say it, Dagnabbit. No. <laughs> ah, screw it. Part's over anyway. Pirate stronghold. I win this round. <laughs> nope. They should all be dead. The only reason I'm up and about that is because of that time shift stone on the boat. So you know! It's time you let go of my ship. I'll wait here, of course. But that makes sense. See you guys in part 13. <laughs> uh... Don't be!